Guys, did you know that you can use RAM as Plex Transcode Storage? You didn't, right? I'll show you how to do it. Now what I am going to do is, I am going to uh, first go on to my Plex Media Server which is installed in my Android box. So what I am going to do now is, only can be done on my Android server. So if you have an Android server at home, please first go to your Android server's interface. Now after going to your Android server's interface, you should be able to see your Docker tab. In the Docker tab, you should be able to see your Plex Media Server. Click on the icon and go to edit. Now what you will need to do is, we will need to uh, create a container path for so that the server can uh, store the transcode files in RAM. So to do that, you will need to select add another path or port option click on that and give a name so this name can be anything that you want so for the container path we will give the name which we will give into our plex media server so i will give what i will give is this for the host path we will give dot sorry uh, slash tmp and after giving that press add after pressing add you will be uh, your path will be added to this place now now currently as i have added that i don't need to apply it but after you add it click on the apply sign and automatically your docker container will restart after the restart is done click done and click on your plex icon and click on web UI. Now here when we create our container path we gave the name as transcode. Copy that path and go to your Plex Media Service interface, go to settings, click on transcoder. If you don't have this option click on show advanced options then you should be getting this interface afterwards paste the container path here after pasting click save changes now all the transcode files of your plex media server will be stored on your ram so you don't need to worry about the storage of your hard drives you just need to worry about the amount of ram that you have on your server so what I recommend is you should at least have around 8 GB for this to work properly because uh, according to the file size of your media it may vary on yours. So thank you. So this is the way that you add uh, the path for Android Plex server so that all the transcode files are stored on the RAM. So subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Have a nice day.